These are two pieces of metal. They aren't magnetic and they don't have any adhesives of any kind on them. The surfaces are smooth and they don't have any noticeable grooves. I can touch them together and they don't stick. However, if I slide them together like this, they stick together like super magnets. They are clearly stuck together and I can't even pull them apart. If I twist them apart, they'll go back to being separate pieces of non-magnetic metal. What's happening? Well, these are actually gauge blocks, which are blocks of smooth metal that are precisely manufactured to be certain lengths so machinists can calibrate their machines and measurement tools. The extremely smooth surfaces are why they stick together. The thing is, nobody is certain about how they stick together. There are several potential explanations that most likely work together to create the effect. First of all, because there is no, nearly no air between the smooth surfaces when pushed tightly together, the air pressure move might push in on both blocks. Second of all, the surface tension from oil and water vapor on both blocks might hold them together. Finally, intermolecular forces might cause attraction since the surfaces are so smooth and the molecules from the blocks are in such proximity. Gauge block ringing has been shown to work in a vacuum with clean blocks and that is evidence that this is actually a factor. It's pretty cool that the molecules are so close together that it makes it hard to pull these blocks apart. Properly rung gauge blocks can hold 75 foot pounds of force before coming apart and this actually is useful so machinists can combine gauge blocks of different lengths to essentially make more gauge blocks of many more lengths than they already have. They generally use the biggest ones they have so they can achieve the desired length without the small tolerances adding up. Hopefully you found this cool. If you did, please consider subscribing and thank you for watching.